welcome to Kit Workshop. Last time we were starting on this stuff here. I'm not gotten that uh, far ahead because we have the Christmas stuff in this in this uh, week here. So, but I promise you a sight from the a picture from the side so you can see how it looks. And we have like uh, the wheelhouse we have ready and the uh, box in front, but not ready because I I just painted this today and glued the front of it on it so you can see. But I have not glued it all together because it's smarter to to paint it before you glue it together because it's easier to paint. So, <clears throat> sorry, that's a reason for that. So, but what I had to do now is I have to sand the, the wheelhouse a little before we glue it all together. And uh, uh, not just sand it, but paint it also. So take the roof up and change the camera. If we can figure that part out so you can see from the top. It's easier to see when I'm doing stuff. But I have been real busy with the with the Christmas Santa's workshop, so I will show to you what I'm making just so if you not have been paying attention to that part. I will change the camera. Oop. See. See. There's the bottom part of the mill. And then we tonight we will in an hour or so we will put that uh, keep on making the top to it. This part where you can see like this one. See, it's difficult to show when the camera is off, but you can see it here. So, and the, the goal is, it has to be a mechanical one, so the wings are rotating and so on. Like in my childhood, when we had, when we had mechanical uh, decoration in the big stores windows, so I, I thought that was kind of fun to make to a, to a change, but now it's the boat we are making. I do this so that the corners are getting nice. I have put a little filler in where there was a little gap in the corners.
but it's barely dry. Because I wanted to, I have put the, the stop motion stuff on hold in this in this Christmas month and then after that we will go back to that again and this one and kids workshop and break and I have another show in mind so feel if there is something I will take a little file so nope it's not here then it's somewhere else where do I have it I have it in here that's why. That's why. Coming, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. See? I have these small. I can see there is some stuff here in the window. small tabs that hold it in place in the in the kit in the laser cut but I thought I had I did so because we need to as you can see in the box here, we need to put doors in and so on on the other side. Can you see? And uh, we have to paint those too. And there's a small door there. But we get to that later on. Now, I will take a cloth. Oh, I will. Just give it a little. paint it and to that purpose we have some white colors and of course I forgot to have something to put it in just a minute go in the kitchen I have remembered the 
the the water and the brushes, but no no nothing to have it in the paint. You know? And if you see, I don't use these colors here that was in the kit because that's some, I don't know what that is. It's not. And then I will take on this side of the camera, take this one and move this over here and you can see I have been painting the blue stuff on this one. So, nope, that is too thick. We will remove that because it will not get smooth. Where do we have? There are traces after the brush, so we will not. Get rid of that before it dries. So, we will, it's acrylic color, so we will put a little water in it. Not much, but a little. Oops. Come on. and it will flow a little bit. Not too much and not too little, that's the coldness. I think we are getting there. See, if not, we will do it again. It feels better. See if it is better. Okay now. You have to give it twice. But, uh, mm.
and you don't want to fill the phrase up. I have a cross in my mouth. So. Normally, I would have airbrushed it, but uh, I guess you don't have an airbrush laying around. So, I will do it in the way you would do it. Don't try to get it all covered in once because you cannot. And then you get. And you can see here, you get. But I think. that we need to fill out, out this too. I just recognized because the plastic stuff don't go all the way through. See, you cannot cover it. Even when there is a lot of pigment in these colors. But uh, that's okay. good thing about this is it dries uh, reasonable fast.
and the other side. You can see if I have put the had put the roof on and glued it to the boat, it would have been much more difficult to paint it. Now it's easier. and a little in the frame. I, we even have to paint the inside also. You can look inside the windows. So, and there is the back side.
and you could wait to paint it inside when you are finished with the front side, but now this is live show. things going. Lose it. Where to hold? Here to hold. Just to fill up the little cracks. So they are invisible. having drops hanging around in the windows. And the doors It always looks a little helpless with the first time of paint. But it will be fine. Because everything shines through. Let it dry a little.
and then in a little while we can little while we can get at it again. So and I have something there I want to remove. Good. We will stop there for a minute. And then because I want to see this the door stop. to cut this because I want to see how it gonna fit <clears throat> because you can see it looks like it's just on the inside and the door there are no I have hope that was all the way through so I will take a scalpel or something Maybe I can use this one, so I can see. Where, where are you? Where are you? It's put on the inside. So we need to do the frames in the opening. So now we know that part. And then we put a little list on when we are done. Uh, and as far as I can see on the drawing here, see also around the windows. Okay. But you know it's not always that the photograph are true to the real deal. Yes, we have some very thin list here to the windows and to the so that's the way it's going to be. Before we can throw this away and take some new stuff. Boop. So what is this? It's only dust from the when I'm when I'm sanding and so on. See, in a little while it's dry, and we can paint it again. See, it's already not totally, but. It will be in a few moments. Oh, there's something there I don't like. Maybe you have to give it up to three times to get it 
get a decent cover. What should we have done without kitchen towel, paper towels? Then let's see, I'll go on this side of the camera. Let me see what the next step is. Where are we going to go next? Uh, all the stuff we need to get behind the cabin or the wheelhouse. I always say cabin, but it is wheelhouse. You can see we have a mast behind there too, and we have something on the roof. We have a, a mast here behind. And then we have the lanterns on the roof and the spot right here. And then we have the front mast. And then we, I think we need to make this before anything else. The front part down to the cabin. You cannot see it here as well as see this drawing so you can see it here this the one where what Okay, we need to have some stuff on there. Yes, and then we oh, this was one you can see here. This is the part we are making now, and then we then we have something here in the middle if we do that. Here's the cabin, then we have something, this one in the middle here, down to where they put the fish tank or something, or they will call it. And then we need to make this one. It looks pretty much like this one. And there is a door down to the cabin. front cabin, so we will get to some very small stuff very soon, shall we see where we, see, it's five already, so we will give it some more.
seen how it start to cover. But now the paint also start to get too thick. We need to have a little more paint and a little more water in it. Ah. this and then some water I should have taken a bigger holder for it Pick a cup. Oh, not that much paint in it. One thing or the other. So, shall we hope that is enough? Or we can still have a dig. is better. Oops, I have forgotten that we just have painted. Yes, this is fine. Not inside the window, but you remove that later. And
then we need a finer brush for that part. <coughs> the inside window part. the back. You can, I don't know if you can see it, but you can still see, see the wood too. side And before I glue this one on and the rest of the stuff, I, the deck has to get a lacquer. So, and a rail around to railing.
<coughs> and then we can go around, around one more time to get the stuff in the window frame. And the door frame. Maybe we should put a little color on too. I kind of have to focus a little here. Yes, I'm the worst person in the world to multitask. That's not my strong side. Only one thing at a time. But what, one good thing about this kit is that it's laser cut, so the big one I made was you had to cut every little piece out yourself. And of course that is satisfying, but the laser cut make a nicer job. can say that. So, oh, I shouldn't have done that, but I did. So, 
Hey, and down on my painted. But you can see where I'm going here. And that was as far as we got today. And they need to be cleaned as best possible in a little while, but you can see it will be fine with a white cabin and a blue, a mild, white uh, wheelhouse and a blue top and uh, so on. We will make it really nice. So, But I will say thank you for today and you can follow the, the first and all the other stuff I have done on pixelfantasies.com and on YouTube and please subscribe if you are so inclined. Uh, it's always nice to know if somebody cares of what we are doing here. So, but uh, until next Tuesday and uh, then we'll see you again and in a little while we will get the, the Christmas stuff. So, bye bye.